cold. Boy. Woo! There goes the wind chill. Beautiful day though. Yeah. Freezing cold. Seems to be running good today. Quick warm up. Car coming there, car coming there. Go across all these stupid lines. Get upright. Nail it. Probably gonna blow back onto the road later, but hey, good deed every day. Very dry, cold day, I would guess. Low 40s, maybe high 30s. The wind chill is definitely cutting in, but I'm not worried about the road too much. The tires are gonna take a long time to warm up, but uh, I don't know. Should be okay. I won't lean it much. Brings the Eileen a lot. So, right now, uh, I have a lot of topics I can do while I ride, talk about, but um, a lot of them, uh, go ahead and let me know if you'd like to hear something. I'm not going to do a lot of skill videos because I haven't had a lot of skill and so I'd have to like, I can, I'll research it and practice it and do it multiple times, you know, so I can show you how to do it, but I'm not going to just start randomly talking about a skill because it's not my forte yet. Let me know if you want me to do a specific uh, video on like skills or how to do stuff and I'll uh, try and do my best to talk about that. Um, so I'll probably just pick other topics that aren't skills related, like general fun random stuff. Yeah. That's the one thing that about this bike, like, has so much engine braking that if I kind of rely on it for a corner, and then I don't have it, I'm like, oh, jump on the brakes, and then that's not always a good thing, so. A little sketchy, but, uh, engine braking is nice, but if you have a lot of it, just... I gotta get used to it. Making sure that I uh, anticipate a lower gear if I want to use that. There's a nice little beamer. Silver with authentic rims. Euro. I feel like I'm flying right now. Good grip with my knees. Hands aren't really, you know, they're on the handlebars, but so really, really light grip. Just cruising. Even though it's not that fast, it's still fun on a motorcycle. And sketchy corner. I just gotta attack it. Attack it! No fear, only respect for physics. That's right. Expert on physics. Can tell you anything you want to know about physics. That's one thing, like, 
if you wanted me to get into like some weird scientific explanations, I probably could. Like physics, chemistry. You want a little lesson on some uh, oh Newtonian physics, or I can do some modern physics too. Whatever, fun stuff, and I can add. Uh, oh, it's not a school day. I don't know who's all watching this, but even if this is like an older video and it's been up for a couple months, just uh, comment below and I should see that and I can try and let you talk about something for you. It's a yellow light, preload, and into it. Not a Ninja 300. So you have six gears, and my bike tops out at mechanically like 120, maybe 120, a little bit above that. So six gears, 120 miles per hour, and third gear takes me past 50 miles an hour. Go figure that one out. I don't really know exactly the physics of that. So, if that's something else, you want me to talk about the physics of bikes? How they lean, how they stick to the road, how they... The wheel rotating keeps you up when you go no hands, like, you know, this. Oh, the wrong gear there. You know, you're like cruising along, you go no hands, like, what keeps you up? Well, the bike's gonna go straight forward because you got a lot of mass in the wheels. And I can explain some of that in a semi-detailed, semi-scientific, semi-straightforward way. Or if you want the chemistry of combustion, that's already been done a million times, so go check out some other YouTube video. Yeah, like if someone's already done something and you want me to talk about it, I'm fine with that, but... It's a great base of knowledge just up there in the search bar. So, lots of cars today here. I should lane split. Ha 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 ha. I'm going to stay in this lane, hoping that some of these cars get into the turn lane and I can advance a couple spots, but if they all turn off, then I might jump that. Woo! Bike feels alive. Riding on that power band, 7,000 RPMs, woo, sweet. A little more vibrations, but not really very balanced V-twin. Could probably explain the physics of that too, but uh, you know, I don't know. Second gear, oh, second gear takes me past 50, that's right. Like, why do you need that? Two gears to get past 50, Two more to get past a hundred, maybe. No lane splitting at any time. Which I probably shouldn't talk about because someday I'm just gonna do it. And it's just gonna happen and someone's going to feel skipped and they will just have to deal with it like a big boy. And I'm not going to care too much. So look at those clouds. They're like all around the sun. From me to the sun. They're like kind of that thing. Like they're shadowing like this whole city or something. Like, you know how they're all up there in like a circle around the sun. Kind of not quite a circle, but a group. Like if you look to the right, like away from the sun, there's 
there's no clouds over there. So like, why are they all like right in between us and the sun right now? Because the clouds aren't that far up, so it's not like it's covering the whole state or the whole world. Oh, more physics. That's how you get around traffic in Oregon. There's no good way to do it. Nope, none at all. Oh, dang it. Oh, dang it. Glass. Why the? Oh, my goodness. No. No glass. Bad stuff. That's the one. It's the Yoshi. Looking nice. And I'm going to leave this in gear. Just so somebody can't slip it away. I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to do because I'm so late. I think I'm just going to walk into class super late. Because that's looking good. Older Honda Shadow. He looks pretty rough. Remember, check everything. Just a bunch of glass around. It's crazy stuff. Bandit, another couple of Honda Shadows. Yeah. Jixer. Good stuff. Not many leader bikes around. Looks like a 600. Not quite sure. Woohoo, not using the crosswalk. Thug life. For my friends to use that phrase. Thug life. Yeah, you know who you are. And you overuse it. Every time. <laughs> Come on. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Let me know if there's any good topics you want me to talk about, and I'll try and add those to my list and talk about them. Um, pretty much can do anything. Could do some survival ones too. You guys like outdoor survival? Let me know in the comments down below. And I will do a fun video about it. Can't really demonstrate any like, you know, fires or anything like that while I'm riding, but I can talk about it. Explain all that mindset things you should be how to do it. Okay, this vlog is over now.